Hey everyone, it's your personal trainer, Coach Kozak. And I'm Claudia, and this is the chest workout. It's a great routine for both men and women, and it only requires a pair of dumbbells. The weight that you use today will be totally dependent on your fitness level. I'm gonna do all of the intermediate through advanced modifications today. And I'm gonna do all of the beginner modifications. Now you will see me use a mat because we're gonna do some movements from our knees. So depending on your surface, get a mat or a towel just to give yourself some comfort. There's no warm up required for this workout, but if you'd like to do one, get your heart pumping, get the, some uh, blood in your muscles, you can go ahead and click the link up top and start the warm up. Otherwise, we're gonna get right into this thing. Let's do it, ready? Let's go, I'm ready. Don't leave me hanging. Sorry. Oh my goodness. Okay, we're actually gonna start down on the ground and we're gonna do a hand release push up. So I'm gonna do it from up top on my feet. Claudia's gonna go ahead and do it from her knees, so that's why she set up her mat. So hand shoulder width apart. We're gonna go ahead and bend at the elbows, lower your body all the way down, bring your hands up and press back up. So it's a hand release push up. We're actually totally bringing our hands up off the ground on this one. So you're forced to press up from a dead stop position. Bring that core up with you, keep your core tight. On this one, it's really easy to like just press up and then let your butt hang behind you, but don't do that. Bring those hips and that core up with you along the way. Making sure to breathe all the way up, all the way down. And you're gonna notice we're not gonna count reps today, but instead we're just gonna get as many done in the allotted time frame. Good. Not much more on this first one. Keep it going. I know we're jumping right into a tough one today. And three, two, one, zero. Good. Okay, we are gonna need your dumbbells for the next one. We're staying down on the ground. We're moving into a lying dumbbell fly. So we're lying back, feet are flat on the ground, little bend in both elbows. We're gonna spread your arms, lower the dumbbell, stretch your chest all the way down, and then squeeze your chest, bringing the dumbbells back together. So stretching your chest, keeping a little bend in those dumbbells, or a little bend in your elbows, and pull them back together. Really feeling that chest stretch on this one. And be careful not to bounce your arms off the ground at the bottom of the position. Definitely be easier just to let them flop and get a little rebound going, but really want you to avoid that today. Control the dumbbells throughout the movement. Feel that chest engage as it stretches and contracts up at the top. Now you notice we're both doing the same movement on this one. So it really just comes down to you choosing a weight that you feel comfortable with. We encourage you to make this workout your own today. Good. Getting as many reps in as you can in a lot of time period. You start to feel comfortable with it. You can pick up the pace a little bit. Not much left on this one. We're almost there. Let's go for 10 more seconds on this one. Good. Five, four, three, two, one. Nice, okay. Dumbbells to the side. Moving into another push-up variation. This one specifically really targets the chest. We're gonna have your fingers out on this push-up variation. Hands are a little bit wider than normal. Finger out push-up. Let those elbows come out to your side as you lower your body and press back up. Again, you decide if you wanna be up on your feet or if you need to be on your knees for this one. Stay nice and controlled. To lower your body into your elbows. Get to about a 90 degree angle. And back up, good. Starting to feel it now. <laughs> <laughs> Anytime you know Claudia's Get, uh, feeling it is when she's getting tired. <laughs> Good. Think it's I, usually when I'm quiet. It is. It is usually when you're quiet. I don't want anybody to hear me suffer. <laughs> <laughs> Although they probably would love to. <laughs> well, unfortunately, I don't have that luxury. <laughs> Good. <laughs> Keep it going, guys. You got it. Squeeze that chest up at the top. Stretch and squeeze. Good. Let's go for just five more seconds. Four, three, two, one, zero, and we are done with that one. That one really stinks. Grab one dumbbell, we're on our feet. We're gonna keep this pace up. We're doing a Sven press. Squeezing the dumbbell on either side. Arms extended out in front of you. Squeeze it as you pull it in and press it out. Why don't you try your best to keep your arms parallel to the ground. 
and keep squeezing. Don't just hold it, but actually squeeze and force that chest to engage. Good. Ah, my chest is starting to feel it. Yeah, this one really does not feel that good after those push-ups. <laughs> Feels amazing. I love it when people are like, how do you work your chest without getting down on the ground for push-ups? Yeah, good answer right here. You really can't. Squeeze. Good. Making sure to breathe, guys. Keep it up. Fighting through that burn. Our arms are burning too. You're not alone. Keep it going. Let's go in 10 seconds on this one. Fight through it. Fight through it. You got it. Almost there in five, four, three, two, one, zero. Okay, let's go to the ground. Okay. We're doing a dumbbell floor press. We need both dumbbells for the next one. Lying flat on our back. You can go ahead and put your feet down for balance. So we're just gonna do a standard floor press or chest press, lowering the dumbbells, trying to keep them on, over your elbows, not bouncing your upper arm off the ground. Lower them and press them back up. All the way up, all the way down. Now ideally, we'd have a bench for this one and we could get a little bit more range of motion in our chest. If you have a bench, feel free to use it. Otherwise, getting down on the ground works great too. Good. Pushing through, getting as many reps in as you can in that allotted time period. But again, being careful not to bounce those arms and cheating yourself on it either. Nice work, keep it moving. Pushing through. Well, your chest, shoulders, and triceps are probably starting to catch on fire a little bit. That's all right. That's just that lactic acid starting to burn. You can fight through that signal. Don't listen to it. Your muscles got plenty left. Just keep it moving all the way up, all the way down. Nice. Good, good, good. Keep it up. Let's go another 10 seconds on this one. How many reps can you get? Let's go. Push the pace, guys. Push the pace. Breathe. You got it. Let's go. Five, four, three, two, one, zero. Good. Okay, next, we're moving into a dumbbell pull over. So, again, from the ground, I'm going to do an ISO hip up or actually bring my hips up where Claudia's going to keep her hips down. You choose which one is right for you today. Both palms are facing one another, slight bend in the elbows. Bringing those dumbbells all the way back. Feel that stretch and pull them back over until your arms are perpendicular to the floor. Good. Breathe. And if having two weights is too much for you and you need to drop one, you can. Just go ahead and move it back with just one dumbbell and just ride on over your chest. Yeah, and it's important you just make this work out your own, guys. Being careful not to bounce that or bounce your dumbbells off the floor either. Just a light tap. And if you don't quite have the mobility to go all the way back without causing pain in your shoulders, then maybe, you know, half the way back here and forward is okay. This, act this exercise will actually help you improve your mobility so you'll get a little better at it every time. Just keep coming back, repeating it, and you'll get a little bit better every time. Nice work, keep it up. Let's go 10 more seconds on this one. Almost there, almost there. Breathe. You got it. Let's go five, four, three, two, one, zero. Nice. All right, so we're only gonna take a 10 second break. That's the end of round one. So you pretty much just have enough time to turn around and get ready for these hand release push-ups. About one more time through. So we're up in push-up position in three, two, one, dropping all the way down. Release, hands up, and press up. So the second round, now that you're a little more familiar with the movements, I want you to try to pick up the pace. Put it all out there, give it everything you've got. No holding back. Let's go. Let's go out there and get it. Breathe. Nice. One rep right into the next. Keep that core tight. Make sure to bring your hips up with you. Do not let your hips sink down to the ground. Good. One into the next. Breathe. You got it. Keep it going, guys. You're doing great. Fight through that burn. This is definitely one of the tougher ones today. Good. One right into the next. Almost there. Let's go 10 seconds. Last 10 seconds. How many can you get? How many can you get? 
Good. Five, four, three, two, one, ah, zero. Oh, nice. horrible. <laughs> dumbbell horrible. flies are next. Getting right into position. Grab both your dumbbells. No break, no stalling. Let's go. One fly right into the next. A little bend in those elbows like you're wrapping your arms around a tree and squeeze that chest up at the top. Good work, keep it up. You got it. Getting a little bit better with every rep. Focus on what brought you here today, whatever that is, whatever goal you're working on. Think about it, be there right now. Gotta use it throughout your day. Good, stay focused. One rep into the next, breathe. Feel that stretch and squeeze. You got it, you got it, good. No letting up, no letting up. Let's go 10 more seconds, that's it. Fight through it. Almost there. Let's go five, four, three, two, one, zero. Okay, dumbbells are to the side. We have our last set of push-ups for the day. Ugh. Fingers out push-ups, so fingers out this time. Again, we're up, hands are a little bit wider than normal. We're all the way down, all the way up. Bring those elbows to a 90 degree angle. Feel that chest engage. Good. You got it, guys. Think about what brought you here today. You can do it, stay focused, stay motivated. Keep pushing yourself, because nobody else is gonna do it for you. All comes down to you, it's all in your head, right here. No giving up. Good. Pushing through, pushing through. We're burning too. Thousands, maybe millions at home, all feeling that same burn. You're not alone. We're fighting through right here. Let's go. Come on, Hasfit Tribe. Let's go. What you got? What you got? Let's go. Five, four, three, two, one, zero. Ooh. Up on our feet. We need one dumbbell. We got Sven Press next. Dumbbells up. Squeeze that dumbbell. Bring it into you. Squeeze and press it out. This one's pretty deceiving, I'd say. Uh, yeah. Like it doesn't look like much, but <laughs> when you combine it with everything else, it definitely works. Good. You got it, guys. We don't have much left. If you've been saving it, now's the time to put it out there. No more push-ups. No more push-ups. No more push-ups. Cross that off the list. Can you tell those are Claudia's favorite? Just keep that in mind. Come on. I'll definitely get you through this. Let's go. Stay focused, you got it. Good job, guys. Let's go 10 more seconds on this one. Time is flying by. Flying by, good. Woo. And five, four, three, two, one, zero. To the ground we go, we need both dumbbells. We got dumbbell floor press. Depending on the weight you chose today, you're either gonna go fast on this one or struggle to get just a few reps out. Either way, what's important is you just keep moving. Don't pause this video. Don't take a break. If you have to switch to some of the easier modifications, that's okay. We just keep going. You got it. We're going hard and fast today. Very efficient workout. Getting a lot done in a short period of time. Good job, guys. Good job. Keep it up. Breathe. About halfway done with this one already. Nice work. Good. Keep grinding. Keep grinding. You got it. Let's go 10 more seconds on this one. That's it. You can do anything for 10 seconds. Come on. Let's go. Don't give up. Don't slow down. You got it. Let's go. Five, four, three, two, one, zero. We're right into the pullover. So if Ooh. you're going hips up, go hips up. If not, this is it. Start pulling over. No break. One right into the next. Slight bend in those elbows. Feel that stretch and pull over. This one not only works your chest, but also you're gonna get a little added bonus of getting some back in. And if you're doing the ISO version, you get some glutes, hamstrings, core, hitting a lot of muscles with this one exercise. You got it, and good Remember work. guys, no shame if you gotta drop a dumbbell. No shame if you gotta switch it to one, that's very true. Just keep moving. That's what it's all about. Don't give up. Come on. Not cheating me if you do, cheating yourself. 
Don't cheat yourself. Let's go. You're better than that. You're worth more than that. Let's go. This is it. Last set. Let's go 10 more seconds. That's it. Ah, so close. Here it is. Here it is. Let's go. Five, four, three, two, one, zero. And done. Ah, let's see if my arms can get me up off the ground after that one. <sighs> <laughs> Thank you so much for joining us today. If you like this workout and you've been working out with us for a while, we'd ask that you please check out our Patreon page where you can help support us and our mission to keep these great workouts for free for everyone around the globe. That's right. And if you like this workout, and we know you did, go ahead and give us a big thumbs up and subscribe to our YouTube channel. That way you never miss a workout from HasFit. Make sure to check out HasFit.com for hundreds of free workouts just like this one. Free complete fitness programs, meal plans, all there for you for free. That's right. And don't forget to find us on your favorite social media, whatever that is. We're on Facebook, Twitter, Instagram, Snapchat. Pinterest, you name it. We're everywhere. Oh, Come yeah, find us. That. <laughs> <laughs> There's so many. <laughs> Hard to keep track of them. Come find us. We'd love to connect with you online. Yes. Thank you for giving us the pleasure of working out with you today. I'm Coach Kozak. And I'm Claudia. Chest is feeling good. <laughs> and we will see you at your next workout. <laughs>